Hello YouTube. In this video, I will show you how to use EIS File Explorer. EIS File Explorer is one of the most advanced and powerful file manager application on Android. EIS File Explorer can manage file on Android the way we do most on Windows PC. So these are the top 10 most useful features of EIS File Explorer that you do not have in your default file manager on android so let's open es file explorer so this is the icon of es file explorer now let's open it so as you can see we have internal storage and sd card just like on windows pc we can see all the uh, uh, internal storage and some uh, storage that connected to our pc so it looks the same in the android uh, phone by using EIS File Explorer and as you can see here in the lower part we have music folder, movie folder, a folder, images and etc etc and like for example you like to open a music folder just tap it and you can see all the music you have from your internal storage and SD card over here if you want to play a music this uh, is file explorer also have a built-in uh, music player so let's try to play oops uh, anyway guys I will not play this uh, music because uh, better not to play to avoid uh, copyright claim so now let's go back to the home page and as you can see we have movie folder so if you will open movie folder uh, you will see uh, all the videos and uh, movies that you have from your SD card and internal storage like for example this one Black Widow if you will play this one uh, also have a default uh, video player so it's just like an application that all in one because it has a video player music player and everything okay we have app folder if we will open it we can see all the installed application on our phone so let's try to open it so these are the apps that already installed on my phone so let's go back to the home page and we have the next one images so like for example you like to browse all the images that you have from your SD card and internal storage you just only click it to open and as you can see we have a lot of pictures inside just like this uh, one you can see only one picture but actually inside it has 124 pictures inside so this is this is all the pictures that I have inside of this uh, folder so it, this is me uh, I can see that and this is my cat this is my cat you see this is a siamese cat now let's go back to the home page again so okay before we start the top 10 most useful features of es file explorer uh, before that i will explore you first to the next uh, page of this uh, es file explorer so if you will slide it to the right you will see it like this now if you will ex uh, slide one more time to the uh, left you can see it like this so that's it and now let's move on to the top 10 most useful features of es file explorer so number one how to create a new folder so to create a new folder you just uh, tap the plus uh, button this one and if you tap that just uh, select folder so and click ok so as you can see we have already created a new folder now let's move on to the next one number two how to rename a folder so to rename a folder just press and hold the folder that you want to rename and click this uh, button rename and i will rename it like uh, rename 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 okay so it's already renamed the folder and to enter the uh, name the new name just click ok okay now let's move on to number three how to copy paste any file on android so to copy paste file on different destinations so you, all you need to do is select your uh, file to copy so like for example this one so just uh, 
click copy both on this one copy and like for example i will uh, copy it to this folder so just open this folder and click paste button so paste and that's it now let's move on to the next one how to move file or folder to sd card so like for example i will move this uh, folder to sd card this one or this and this one so i have to move these two folders to sd card so all you need to do is click the cut button and slide it to the right so as you can see we have sd card here so i will open sd card copy paste over here and then simply click uh, paste button so as you can see the folder rename and rename folder is already here so that's it now let's go to the next one how to delete files on android so to delete the files on android is simply select the files that you want to delete like for example this one and this one i want to delete this so all you need to do is click this uh, delete uh, button and okay now let's move on to the next uh, one uh, how to restore deleted files so if you want to restore deleted files all you need to do is click these uh, three lines on the upper left side so click this one and slide it up and as you can see we have recycle bin so open recycle bin and we have a lot of recycle folders and files inside of the recycle bin so like for example i will restore this one just simply select that one and press restore button and wait for a moment okay successfully restored okay let's go to the next one how to create a new text document so if you like to create a new text document simply click uh, plus button this one click and select word and if you like to rename it uh, you can rename it a uh, new text a new text document and press ok now we have already new text document so ok let's go to the next one how to compress file on android so to compress file on android you first to do is uh, create a folder so create folder and okay now it's already here so if you like to compress your files just select it and select and cut and move it to the folder that you want to compress now paste so all these uh, files or pictures is already inside the folder of this folder so as you can see it's, uh, it's already inside now if you like to compress this folder all you need to do is uh, tap and hold now as you can see we have this uh, three dots button over here so just click it and press this uh, compress button and zip or it's up to you seven z or zip so i will uh, press ok and as you can see we have a zip file so all you need to do is delete the uh, old folder so let's go to the next one how to extract a zip file or unzip this uh, zip file so to extract this file like for example this one just click it and hold and as you can see we have three dots button here just click it and extract extract okay and as you can see we have this folder again so open it and everything is back to decompress so that's it now let's go to the next one how to set password on a folder on android so all you need to do is click it and click a three dots and encrypt encrypt so to set the password uh, just uh, enter the characters that you want so like for example one two three four five you just and just confirm one two three four five and click ok okay so for now as you can see folder is, is still locks the same but if you will click it 
you cannot open these files inside of this folder because these files is already have protection so to open it just click it and enter your password so because i put uh one two three four five so i will use use it again one two three four five and click ok and as you can see i am already here in the picture it's already open by using a password so this one this one oops cancel so this one and this one and this one and this one if you have if you don't know the password you cannot open it so that's it so okay guys let's go to the last one how to download es file explorer so all you need to do is open your uh, google chrome or internet browser so on the search bar just type es file explorer es apps file explorer and don't forget to add that ap key and go ahead now let's find ap key pure so this one APK Pure. So we can download EIS File Explorer file manager from APK Pure. So let's open it. And you can download it right here. But for me, I don't need to download this uh, app because I already have. So I have to cancel it. So before I close this uh, video tutorial, I need your uh, uh, help. Uh, can you please uh, rate this uh, video because I want to know uh, how to improve my next uh, video. Uh, upload so thank you very much for watching guys and see you next time